I'm James Carney here, and John Carney as well. We're going to be back, and uh, this will be a uh, twofer. We'll have two peppers that we will be trying out today. Uh, one, I was uh, informed, I thought it was the Avi Amarillo, uh, which is about 50,000 Scoville, so a milder pepper. It's about uh, the hot, regular uh, orange habanero will be about six times hotter than that. Uh, looking at it though, I think it is the Avi Limon, which I don't know the skull go on, I'll have to check it out later, but it's probably about the same. And it's still a mild pepper, uh, indigenous to Peru. Uh, the other pepper we have is a, let's see here, it's got a number, it's uh, PI281429. It is a habanero variety. We're going to be trying the Avi Limon first uh, to show you what it looks like. Give you a little bit of a picture right there, that's uh, one half of it right there. And uh, take a look at the, the PI right there. Pretty nice, nice color to it. It's actually got, you might not be able to see it in the camera, but it's kind of a pearly type, you know, pearly orange color to it. Pretty nice. But uh, these are milder, so this probably will not be a long review even though it is a two for So we're gonna go right away with the Avi Limon. And again, these peppers are uh, actually from Judy at pepperlover.com, if you can believe it. Uh, it seems our reviews will be um, exclusively for now, at least, uh, of Judy's peppers. And I'm very much okay with that so far. So uh, this is the Avi Limon, or Amarillo, but I'm really, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's the Limon. Cheers, guys. I think I talked about this right away. Um, there is not a significant amount of heat to it. Um, again, though, the jalapeno doesn't really do much for me at all as far as heat goes. It feels like it's about that level, but it's probably about five to ten times hotter than that, but it uh, doesn't, doesn't really taste that much hotter. What do you think? I mean, it has a kick, but not that much. It has a nice spicy kick. Like, if you use like, something like this, and it's got a nice, nice citrusy banana taste to it. Um, what do you taste that? Um, citrusy. Citrusy. Okay, so, it, you know, I, I hate using that all the time, but it, it just does have that taste to it. Um, the heat's gone. It's, it's, uh, you know, it, it, a little teeny bit of tingling on the tongue. It's not meant to be a hot pepper. Uh, so that's uh, kind of the point I'm making here is I'm not only going to be reviewing hot peppers, but just, you know, maybe some rare, rare peppers as well. Uh, Davi Limon is really nice. I'm not sure how rare it is, but, uh, but I do know that the PI281429 pepper, the habanero, it is a habanero variety. It's lesser heat than most habaneros, so the orange habaneros are around 300,000 Scoville. This is probably around, you know, 150 or 200, uh, or 200,000. So it's still hot, but not that hot compared to what we're eating. Uh, and, but this is a rare pepper, so it's really nice to get your hands on it. You have it on pepperlover.com as well. So, cheers to this. Cheers. It's very tasty. It's, uh, it's sometimes habaneros uh, for me are a little bit. Um, they, have a, they have their own unique taste. Like I can't even really describe it. But when you bite into it, you know this is a habanero. It's a nice taste, but sometimes it's a little overwhelming. This tastes. It has the habanero taste, but it's just right. Um, so I really, really do like this. This would be for me. This would be a, a very mild heat. Um, someone else would probably be a, you know a, a nice hot sauce. Um, a, nice hot, a nice, very hot salsa for them, but uh, this is uh, very, very tasty. Not that hot. Um, on a scale of one to ten, being, you know, like I said, my scale is a little different than other. If you're looking at a maruga or a brain strain, at you know between eight and ten, this would probably be more around four. Uh, the Aji Limon would probably be about one. Uh, that to me. You know, the Limon has a really, really, really nice taste to it, too. That'd be something that I can just have in my pocket, pop it all day long, and be okay with it, no issue at all. So, this was another break for Jonathan. 
Um, honestly, he's, he's pretty thrilled right now. He thought I did. I know that apart from thought I was kidding when I said they weren't going to be that hot. I don't trust him. He doesn't trust me at all. But, um, but now, you know, hopefully I'm building a, building a bridge of trust between us. I'm hoping that you can trust me now. Um, the next peppers we review will be significantly hotter. Um, so you should trust me on that. <laughs> so, uh, thank you so much for watching. You got a two for it. It took us less time than any other video. But again, that's because the heat is, uh, you know, we, we try two mild peppers with two nice, nice peppers. So if you are looking for peppers that aren't so hot that you can try, you know, but it gives you a little bit of a kick, go to Judy at pepperlover.com and ask for some of these delicious peppers. Okay? Thank you so much. Check it out.